get set. We're riding on the internet, cyberspace set free. Hello, virtual reality. Interactive appetite, searching for a website, a window to the world, got to get online. Take a spin, now you're in with the techno set, you're going surfing on the internet. It's us again. This is my brother Peter, mom and dad, and I'm Dasha. Today we're going to be showing our friends Andrew and Lisa the basics of the internet, and we thought you might want to come along. It'll be cool. Now that I've gotten on the internet, I'd rather be on my computer than doing just about anything. It's really cool. The internet. The internet. The internet with the kids' guide to the internet. Take a spin. Now you're in with the techno set. You're going surfing on the internet. Having the internet in our home has had a great impact on our lives, and the kids are improving in their grades and communication skills. Which makes me happy, as I would sure like them to go to college someday. <laughs> so let's get underway. Yeah. Take a spin, now you're in with the techno set. You're going surfing on the internet. Now don't forget to keep it simple for your pals, you two. You guys have learned an awful lot, even though you've only been online a couple of weeks. Hey, you know how to spell Mississippi with one I? M-I-S-S-I-S-S-I-P-I. You're going surfing on the internet. Come on in. Hi, guys. Elves. Hey, Andrew, what's up? Oh. Hey, Andrew, what's up? Now, you make sure Dasha and Peter show you how they've done some of their school reports and not all that cybernet stuff. Take a spin, now you're in with the techno set. You're going surfing on the internet. Okay, guys, the first thing that you need to know is that the internet is amazing. You'll start seeing web pages everywhere. What's a web page? Something ducks walk on? Ha ha. Hold on, sis. Let's start at the beginning. Good idea, Peter, but where do we start? Surfing the World Wide Web. Surfing? That sounds pretty cool already. Ha ha. Then there's email. Email? I heard that's really neat. Ha ha. Yeah, you can even talk with people all over the world on chat lines. Up, they got more stuff than you can imagine. So, where should we start? Let's start with web pages. All web addresses start with http colon double backslash. Then to access the World Wide Web, you type in www. I use the World Wide Web. Yup, they called her the Kitty Hawk. Ha ha, now that's amazing. Want to write a letter to President Clinton? Would he answer us? I bet he would. Let's tell him how much we love the internet. It looks just like it does in our history books, only it seems more real, like we're there. Wow, that's really neat, but how can we get the internet on our computer at home? You're going surfing on the internet. Well, to get started, you'll need to get connected to the internet. You do that through an internet service provider. An internet service provider? What's that? It's a service that connects you to the internet through special super high speed lines. It takes a few minutes until you're online. And we can do it ourselves? Yeah. So we install the disk and we could go online immediately. Yeah, then there was something about fragments or something? That's right. Dad had to defragment the disk too. I'm not really sure what that is, so you better get an adult to help you with it. You're going surfing on the internet. Well, now it's time to get online through our internet service provider. Here we go. Now we need to open our browser. What's a browser? Microsoft Internet Explorer. Or you can download the other popular browser, Netscape Navigator. Okay, so tell us, what does download mean? That's simple. Cool. So that's how you get connected to the internet. Chat lines and... It's all right here at your fingertips. Yahoo, I've heard of that. So it's a search engine, right? <laughs> Can we look at it? Sure, we just click on it and the next thing you know, we'll be surfing the net. Wow, look at all the choices. That's easy. Can we do something fun? Maybe play a game? They sure have a lot of them. <clears throat> Too bad we don't have time to play them. You're right, Dasha, but the tour was awesome. I can't believe how easy it is to surf the net. So let's review a few of the concepts we've been working on, just to make sure I understand. First, we need to get an ISP, or Internet Service Provider. Then, I download or install a browser that allows me to view all information on the net in my computer. Right so far? Then I open my browser to a choice of search engines that look up menus of almost anything I can think of. It sounds complicated. The net is fabulous. What are web addresses? 
All websites have addresses. They all start with HTTP. But where did you get that? We just figured it out. I can't believe how easy it is to get onto the internet. When you hear my parents talking about it, it sounds like it'd be so hard. I told you it was cool. You're going surfing on the internet. I saw something about news and current events online. Ha ha. Yep. I told you it was cool. Oh, I was trying to forget about that. I can get a head start on my homework. Whoa, how'd you do that? <laughs> Show me so I can come back to it later. Lisa, either we're gonna have to get Dad to install the internet right away, or have Mom take us to the library to use it. Hey gang, here's a cool site you want to check next time you go into the movies. Someone said you could order concert tickets over the web. And here's another neat thing you can download off the net. Free screensaver. But let's say I want to use email. You know, email is still the number one use of the internet. And it's really easy to use. And here are some places you can get free email. www.juno.com and www.mailzone.com. Andrew and Lisa's mom's going to be honking any minute. Better pack up your stuff. Thanks, Mrs. Jameson. Well, you're welcome, Andrew. So, did you learn anything important today? Are you kidding? I can't go another day without the internet. Peter showed me how to look up all the information I need on my school project about Egypt. Great. We looked up school stuff and MTV. Oh, it was really cool. Well, good. I'm glad you got some of the important stuff done before you went to the games and MTV, Dasha. We did, Mom. That was definitely cool. Thanks, dude. Bye. Thanks, dude. Bye. Absolutely. See you on the net. Call me the minute you get an email address. Okay. <laughs> and Andrew, we can play interactive games on the net together. Yes. Bye. Bye. You're going surfing on the internet. As a parent, I've never been happier than when my children ask their friends over for an internet computer party. I have to remember the internet is not a regulated environment. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I don't know. What do you think, kids? Yeah. Surf's up. See you on the net. <laughs> <laughs>